Testing, one, two, testing. Hello, Nineveh, can you hear me? Yes, hello. Good to see you. How are you? Uh, fine, fine. <laughs> Did you have a good break? A good vacation? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> vacation from English? Yes, a little vacation. <laughs> okay. Good, good. Okay, excellent. Hello, uh, who do we have? We have Marco and Carla. Hello. Okay, do you have access to the to the platform, Nina? Yes? Mm, no, I have a little problem because the um, enlace. Enlace Quizás de, eh, como que hagan las cookies, grabar, quiero esperarme, limpiar otra vez y volver a intentar. Si tengo claro. problemas, pues. Ok. Ah, pues, mañana. Uh -huh. ah, pues ma mañana puede, puedes intentar. Y, uh -huh. y eh, de, de todo modo, voy a compartir la pantalla ahora y, y ahí trabajamos. Uh -huh. Tengo otra clase a las nueve, entonces hay que, hay, hay que ser puntual, ¿verdad? Voy a uh -huh. terminar a las nueve, cabal. Hello, uh -huh. eh, Carla. Good to see you. Hi. Good evening good evening good evening good to see you too okay excellent okay Man, uh, manuel manny are you there hello good evening okay i hear you but i don't see you maybe you can check your camera Okay, very good. So uh, we're going to start today. And uh, let me just ask, do you have access to the to the platform, El Modulo 2, en inglés corporativo? ¿Ya tiene acceso? Carlos? Yes. Okay. Yes. Uh, Manny, do you have access? Yes. Okay, and Marco and Carla Rojas, do you have access? Okay, and William, hello. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, good to see you. Do you have access to Inglés Corporativo? Yes, Modulo 2. Do you yes, have? Teacher. Okay, excellent, excellent. Okay, very good. So we're going to go ahead and start today. Let me share my, my computer with you. Okay, so. Let's go to Inglés Corporativo. Okay, so you should have access to Inglés Pre-Intermedio Módulo 2. That is, the, that is the course that, that we're doing, okay? Yes. Very good, so uh, maybe Did you get a chance to watch it? Did you watch the, the videos? I didn't time. Okay, well, we're going to do it today. And um, today, the, the topic that we have is frequency adverbs or adverbs of frequency. It's the, the same. Uh, when, when you're speaking about um, how often you do something, for example, I drive to work every day. Every day. Mm -hmm. I take the bus to work mm. on, on weekends, for example. So we need words sometimes that give us eh, la frecuencia de algo, que, que, que tanto 
eh, qué tanto hago un, una situación. Normalmente la, la usamos para describir eh, things that I do often. For example, eh, do you wash your hands? Yes, right? I wash my hands every time before eating. I wash my hands three times a day. Ah. Now they say, why right, with the with the coronavirus, they say you have to wash your hands more, more, right? So let's go see the uh, the lesson that we have is uh, 1.0, which is only which describes the the objective, el objetivo. <clears throat> so let me see. Let me just go. It says, in this lesson, participants will listen to a conversation about how often they do an activity. So I say, how often is frequency? ¿Cuántas veces algo, hago algo? Uh, so we're going to go ahead and watch the video, listen to the video only. Okay. Eh, algunos no, no tuvieron chance de verlo, so let's watch it together, okay? Yeah, let's listen. Hello, we're now in section six. How often do you exercise? In this lesson, participants will listen to a conversation about how often they do an activity. Pay attention to the question, how often, and what they use to respond. I hardly ever exercise. You're really fit, Paul. Do you exercise a lot? Well, I almost always get up early, and I lift weights for an hour. Seriously? Sure. And then I often go inline skating. Wow! How often do you exercise like that? About five times a week. What about you? Oh, I hardly ever exercise. I usually just watch TV in my free time. I guess I'm a real couch potato. In our next session, I will teach you adverbs of frequency so you can respond to how often you do a particular activity. Okay, very good. If you listen, uh, how often? Yo sé que no se and what they used to do. In this lesson, participants will listen to a conversation about hardly ever exercise. Here. In the conversation, the person asks, How often do you exercise? And the person says, always, almost always, five times a week, okay? All of those are adverbs of frequency. So let me share the presentation for today, okay? This presentation is going to cover lesson 1.2 and 1.4, okay? We want to be able to use the frequency adverbs in a conversation, okay? So today you guys are going to do speaking conversation. Eh, este es el video, right? Only listening, okay? This is 1.4, okay? And I want to read it to you, eh, then you can see it later. How often, whenever you see that in English, how often es que te está preguntando qué tanto haces una actividad? Eh, la, las veces que la haces durante el día, durante la semana, durante el mes, how often? So, I lift weights every day. I go jogging once a week. I play soccer twice a month. I swim about three times a year. I don't exercise very often, or you can say, I don't exercise much. Do you ever watch TV in the evenings? Do you see this word ever? Es como decir eh, in Spanish when you say, eh, eh, nunca ves televisión en la tarde. Nunca, eh, usamos ese nunca en español. In English, ever. Do you ever watch TV in the evening? You can answer, yes, I often watch TV after dinner. I sometimes watch TV before bed. 
Sometimes I watch TV before bed. I hardly ever watch TV. No, I never watch TV. Okay, very good. So why do we use the frequency adverbs? We use it to describe how often something occurs. All right. Also, we use it to describe frequency. For example, weekly, daily, monthly, yearly. Y usted, ustedes pueden ver que se le pone ese LI al final. LI. LI. Ese LI, eh, Y, perdón, es como cuando decimos en español semanalmente, diariamente, anualmente. Ese mente is the same in English. Okay? So whenever you see daily, yearly, weekly, y ves esa palabra, esas dos letras al final, L, Y, estás diciendo mente, <laughs> weekly, semanalmente, daily, diariamente, yearly, anualmente, okay? So we use that also. All right, let's go to the next one. Let me just erase. Okay, questions? Hasta ahora? Questions? No? No. Okay, excellent. Good, good. Okay, so, si usamos una escala del 0 al 100, 100 sería algo que yo hago constantemente, todos los días, siempre. Ok. Cero. Never. Ok. So, let's read. Vamos a leer del más frecuente hacia abajo. Ok. En Nineve, do you want to read it? You're going to read okay. estas que están aquí. Ok. Only, only the words. Uh, always. Mm -hmm. Usually, mm -hmm. normally, often, sometimes, occasionally, mm -hmm. seldom, hardly ever, never. Very good, very good. Eh, again, vemos ese L Y al final en algunos. Usualmente, normalmente, occasionalmente. <laughs> All right, it's the same. So remember that, right? Casi, esa es una regla casi para todos los adverbs in English. Okay, very good. So let's go and do an activity. If you want, I'm going to send you this picture, okay? In WhatsApp. Le voy a mandar esta foto. In WhatsApp, okay? Very good. So, el video les explica cómo hacer la estructura. So, we say, for example, I have always done my homework, or I always do my homework. The same, okay? So, puedes usar subject, I, auxiliary verb, have. El auxiliary verb no es necesario, es opcional. Adverb, and then the main verb. I have always done my homework. Susan has always lived in New York. I have never eaten dog food. Okay, very good. And this is the same as the one that we saw. Okay, so if you want to ask a person, y esta la, la actividad que vamos a hacer. If you want to ask a person, you say, how often? Okay. How often do you, how often do you, for example, questions, uh, let's see, uh, William, are you there? Tell me, teacher. How often do you exercise? Uh, 
So, entonces, William, vas a responder con uno de estos. Con cualquiera sería. Depende de la frecuencia que lo haces. Si nunca lo haces, never, never. If you do it every day, often, sometimes, depende. How often do you exercise, William? Hello, William. Un ejemplo, teacher, porque me quedé ahorita. ¿Estás ahí? Sí, claro, ya regresé. How often do you exercise? I never, I go to the gym. Ah, okay, good, good. Never, so zero, zero percent. Yo soy figura, pero no voy. Okay, good. Eh, José, welcome. Are you there? Okay, Katia, how often do you exercise? Hi, teacher. Hello. So, usando los adverbs of frequency, how often okay. do you exercise? Ah, okay. Um, Seldom go to the gym. Okay, seldom. Okay. All right, very good. Seldom es como decir raramente. Okay, something like that. Okay, very good. Who else do we have connected? Uh, Manny, are you there? Yes, teacher. How often do you go to the gym? Or how I, often do you exercise? I normally do exercise Friday in afternoon. Okay. So once a week. Once a week. So puedes decir semanalmente. How do you say it? Weekly. Weekly. Excellent. Good job. Okay. I have some more questions. Uh, let's see. Who else do we have? Uh, Nineveh. How often do you go to the supermarket? I go to the supermarket one time a week. Okay. One, you say once a week. Once a week. Okay. <laughs> Very good. Oh, semanalmente. How do you say it in English? Uh, <laughs> week? Week. 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 Weekly. 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 <laughs> very good. Very good. Okay. Uh, let's see. Carla, how often Hi. do you go to the supermarket? I go to the supermarket every week. Very good. Okay. Another question. Let's see. Who else we have? Oh, todavía you know. <laughs> All right. Uh, very good. Let's see. Uh, Marcos, Bessie, if you can hear me, I digan, digan algo. Digan hello. Okay, William, how often do you check your phone? So, you go back to the vocabulary. How often do you check your cell phone? Always check your phone. <laughs> how about you, how about you uh, Katia? Okay, I will try to check my phone. Perdón. You say usually, yes? I usually check okay. my phone. Very good, very good. How about you, Carla? How often do you check your phone? I always check my phone. Very good, excellent, excellent. Uh, let's see, who else? Who else do we have there? Manny, how often do you check your cell phone? I normally check my phone. Normally, 80%. Of the day. Okay, excellent. Now, we're going to do an activity. Okay, let's see. Uh, uh, whoever wants to go, cualquiera, micrófono abierto, I want you to ask me a question. 
about shower. Uh, remember, if you want to know la frecuencia, que tanto lo hago, how do you ask in English? La estructura. How often do you take a shower? Yes, very good, Marco, very good. How often do you take a shower? Okay, eh, Marco, eh, no sé si tú puedes ver a otras personas ahí con el, con el nombre de ellos. ¿Sí? Uh, sí, sí puedo. Okay, preguntarle a otra persona, cualquier persona que tú quieras. Okay, eh, William Rosales, how often do you take a shower? I always take a shower. Okay, now your turn, William. You're going to ask another person. La pregunta, teacher, se nos fue. Se te fue la pregunta. Sí. Ok, te lo voy a mostrar otra vez. Please. Ahí está. ¿Qué es lo que te preguntó Marco? Sí. Lo sí. mismo le vas a preguntar a otra persona. Si querés, elegí a Katia, digamos. Uh, Lady Katia, how often do you, you take a shower? Okay, I always take a shower. Okay, very good. Katia, your turn now. One, another person. Okay, uh, Ninive, how often do you, do you take a shower? Ninive. Ninive. Sorry, microphone. <laughs> I always take a shower in the morning. <laughs> Very good. Okay, Nineve. Uh, your turn, but now I'm going to show you another picture, okay? Okay. What about this picture? Okay, really. Mm -hmm. uh, my. Uh, Manuel, hi. How often do you brush your teeth? I always brush my teeth. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> now your turn, Manny. Ask another person. Carla, how often do you take the brush teeth? I brush my teeth three times a day. Excellent. Good job. Ok. En el grupo de WhatsApp les puse el, el, el vocabulary del frequency adverb. Ok. El cuadrito. Ok. Carla, your turn. But I'm going to show you another picture. Ok. 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 Eh. Mm -hmm. ¿Cuál es la estructura? Ya se lo olvidó. How... No, no, estoy viendo a quién le pregunto. Ah, ok. <ríe> eh, William Rosales. Tell me, lady. Me Hello. Hello, ah. William Rosales. How yeah. often do you wash your hands? I always... Uh, I... I'm... ¿Cómo la va de mano, teacher? Se me olvida. Eh, ya te lo acaba What? de decir en la pregunta. Sí, se me olvidó. <laughs> One more time, Carla. Ask him. How often do you wash your hands? I always wash my hands. Very good. Okay, okay. William, ask another person the same question. Mm. How often? Another person. Open. Se me olvida la palabra. Oh, how often? ¿Qué es lo que te preguntó Carla? Wash two hands. Repeat, Carla. How often do you wash your hands? And two hands. How often do you wash hands? Wash your hands. Wash your hands. Okay. Repeat the same question, William. Pregúntale a alguien lo mismo que te acaba de preguntar, Carla. 
Another person. How often do you have wife's hand? Lady Katia. Okay, Katia, how often do you wash your hands? I always, no, I always, always, always mm. wash my hands. Always. Always. I always wash my hands. Okay. Excellent. Katia, ask another person. Okay. Uh, Mejía. Mm -hmm. Okay. How often? Do you? Se congeló un poquito. Can you repeat, Katia? Okay. How oh, how often do you wash your hand? Manny. Manuel. Are you there? No, yo creo que Manuel no está. Okay, William. Okay, we have a, another person there. Otra persona que es, es José Ángeles. Bienvenido, José. Eh, José, cuando tú quieras hablar, tenés que quitar el mute. Porque no te escuchamos. Tenés que quitarle el mute. Y así te podemos escuchar. No te escuchamos, José, porque estás en mute. Okay, another question. This one here. Studying English. How can I ask a question to a person? How often do you study English? How often do you study English, Lady Nineveh? Nineveh, how often does, do you study English, dice William? I always study English. <laughs> uh, every day. <laughs> not, every day. Every day. Four, One, four times a four, day, you say. Four times, four times a week. <laughs> ah, okay, that's good. Four times a week. Good, good. Excellent. Okay, let me see. Do, that's it. Finish. Finish. Okay, very good. Now we're going to do an activity. I'm going to put you in groups and you're going to ask cosas así como estas. Por ejemplo, how often do you go to, to, let's see, to church? How often do you go to your church? How often do you read a book? How often do you go to the movies? Ya ustedes se pueden imaginar. Okay? So, Una persona pregunta how often, la otra persona va, va a contestar con el vocabulario. Se lo mandé en el grupo de WhatsApp. Ya les mandé el, el vocabulario de la frequency adverbs. Y después va a preguntar la otra persona, y etc. ¿Ok? Vamos a estar en grupos de tres. ¿Ok? So, let, okay. Me, let me stop. Let me see. Ok. Ahorita están viendo mi no pantalla. Nada. Ahorita están viendo mi pantalla, no. 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 Yes, teacher. Yes. Sí. Okay, very good. Okay, let me stop. All right, we have nine people, so we're going to go in groups of three. Three groups of three. Okay. Alguna persona como Marco y Betsy no las puedo ver. No sé si están conectadas. Hello. Okay, good, good, Betsy. Sí, aquí estoy, aquí estoy. Excelente, solo que no lo, ve, no lo vemos, pero sí lo escuchamos. Ok, les voy a mandar una invitación. Ustedes van a darle click donde dice Join, para que ustedes vayan a su grupo. Eh, lo voy a dividir en, en grupos de tres, ok? So, ahorita lo voy a dividir. Eh, Bueno, dice ocho participantes. Alguien se acaba de ir. Ah, no, no, son ocho conmigo. Sí, okay. no. Entonces sería grupo de dos. Ok, Delen Join, ese mensaje que van a recibir, acepten ese mensaje que van a recibir en Zoom.
Hi, Marcos. Hi, Carla. How are you doing? Hi, Marcos. Is it Marco or Marcos? Uh, without S, Marco. Marco. Hi, Marco. How are you? I'm fine. How are you? Fine. Okay. Uh, uh, why do you don't put a picture in your in your profile? Computer? Uh, okay. Uh, because I have a trouble with my camera, but uh, I hope to by tomorrow. Um, ¿Cómo se dice mejorar? I, I, it will fix it. I will fix I'll it fix, or uh -huh, I will improve my travel with, with the camera. Okay, uh, no problem, Marco. So, uh, Carla, you're going to ask Carlo a question. And then, and I'm sorry, Marco. You, Carla, you're going to ask Marco a question. And then, Marco, you're going to ask Betsy. Betsy, you're going to ask William. And then you continue. Okay? Okay. Okay. Perfect. Okay, Marco, how often do you eat pupusas? Mm -hmm. uh, I normally eat pupusas uh, weekly. Excellent. Good job. Your turn, Marco. Okay. Eh, ¿Puede ser la misma o hay que cambiarla? No, change it. No, change ah, okay. it. No, change it. Okay. Um, Betsy, how often do you travel in El Salvador? Uh, well, I usually travel in El Salvador. It's okay. <laughs> uh -huh. I usually travel. So, I, I, ahí le estás diciendo, Marco, cuántas veces, veces o, o qué tanto viaja al Salvador o viaja dentro del Salvador? Um, para decir dentro del Salvador. Ah, how often do you travel inside of El Salvador? Uh, inside. Okay. Mm -hmm. I usually travel inside in El Salvador. Okay. All right, very good. Betsy, you can ask William a question. William, how often do you see a football? Uh, it's okay? Yeah. How often do you see football? In, in TV? Yes. On TV. Okay. I can see football in the television. Uh -huh, pero how, how often? often? How often? Uh, I, I watch TV, uh, play for, uh, for them. such a football uh, weekend. Repeat? Uh, I watch football in TV uh, weekend. Weekly. 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 Yes, okay. very good. Okay, William, your turn. Continue. Sigan así. Okay, go. Okay. How often do you go to the dinner out, outside in a restaurant? Mm -hmm. I usually go to the restaurant. <laughs> How how often do you go to the supermarket? I go to the supermarket one time a week. Okay. One time? A week? A week. A week. Yes. A week. Good. Good. A week. <laughs> How often do you... <laughs> I'll give you I'll give you some ideas. Uh, uh -huh. Movie. Uh, yeah. What about um, eating Chinese food? Eating pizza. Uh, uh, okay. Netflix. Hmm? Uh, ah, yeah. How often do you watch Netflix? I always. Always. <laughs> 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 No, watch. To no, watch. <laughs> okay. uh, how often do you cook in the diner? Always I have to cook to the diner. 
Okay. Good. <laughs> um, how often do you go to the school with your kids? Repeat, please. <laughs> how, how often do you go to the school with your kids? No, no, how no. often do you go to school with your kids? Que, que lo lleva. Ajá, que lo lleva. Ah, entonces, <laughs> you, 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 you should take, you should use the word, the verb, take. How often how do you often take? Do you take your kids to the school? Mm. Yes, sir. Okay, take. Uh -huh. Ajá. Yeah, I always take my kids. At the school. Okay. <laughs> okay, good. Okay. Okay. How often do you do you go to the to the I say salon? Ah, salon. Yes, very good. Uh <laughs> Good. Me perdió, um, How often do you go to the salon? I occasionally. No he escuchado a José. José, ¿estás ahí? No se escucha, eh. Fíjate, no te escuchamos, José. Tendrías que revisar tu audio. No te escuchamos, José. Sí, la, lastimosamente no te escuchamos. Hay que, tienes que revisar tu dispositivo. Cuando, cuando ingresas a Zoom, te da la opción y dice iniciar con el audio de la computadora. Y allí solamente le pones la espiga, la conexión de los audífonos. Bueno. Tienes que revisar eso. ¿Ok? Um, ahí después vamos a trabajar en eso. Ok, very good. So, uh, let's go back now, and I have an activity that, that we're going to do, a grammar exercise that we're going to do, okay? okay. Uh, we're going to go, re uh, yeah. Okay, close the rooms. We have one minute. Okay. Uh, Ahora, José, lo que vamos a hacer es... There you go. Okay, okay. Welcome back. So very good. I heard I heard very good questions and very good answers. Uh, some people say, for example, they asked, How often do you watch Netflix? Ah, very good, very good question. Uh, Betsy, uh, let me see. I have some questions here, Betsy. Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Okay. No sé si puede ver mi pantalla, ¿sí? Yes, I do. Okay, excellent. So, we have here some questions that I just want to ask you, okay? Okay. Yo voy a escribir tu respuesta. Okay. How often do you eat Chinese food? Um, I eat Chinese food uh -huh. sometimes. Okay, very good. Very good. Excellent. Uh, let's see. Nineve, how often do you watch a movie? Nineve, how often I, do you watch a movie? 
I always watch a movie. Okay, very good. Okay, so this is what I wanted to show you. Nineveh, very good. El, el adverb, el frequency adverb, normalmente va antes del verbo. Do you see? ¿Cuál es mi verbo aquí? Watch. Lo voy a poner en rojo. Okay. Ese es mi, mi verbo. El frequency adverb goes before. Okay? Very good. Do you understand, William? Yes? Yes. William, okay. The next one is for you. How often do you watch Netflix? Uh, and sometimes watch Netflix. Okay. Very good, William. Uh, let's see, Marco. How often do you cook breakfast for your family? Uh, in my case, I never cook breakfast. Okay. Because I, I don't know how to do that. Oh, my God. <laughs> do you know how to cook frijolitos, eggs? Yes? Ah, sí, es solo para llenar el campo. Ah, well, there you go. Good job. So, very good, Marco. I never... Oh, se me olvidó el verbo cook. Cook. There you go. So, I put the verb here. And before the verb, I use the frequency adverb. Very good. Uh, let's see. Katia, how often do you go to the doctor? Yeah, I seldom go to the doctor. Okay. Very good. Okay. Again, aquí está el verbo go. Before the verb, I have the frequency adverb. Excellent. Good job. Uh, let's see. Manny, are you there? Or se fue Manny. Uh, Carla, how often do you get sick? Uh, we can't hear you. Está en mute. Está en mute, Carla. Okay, now speak. How often do you get sick? <laughs> huh? I can. Huh? I lost. La perdida. In the question. <laughs> okay, oh no. In the mute. Uh, ah. I seldom sick. Ah, you need a verb. I seldom, and then you need a verb. I seldom get sick. Ahí está. Very good. Excellent. Do you see now? The verb is there. Mm, okay. So, you have to remember the vocabulary, the frequency adverbs. In WhatsApp, I put the vocabulary. Ya, ya lo vieron. El cuadrito. Okay. In WhatsApp. Okay. Okay. Very good. Now, we're going to do this exercise here. Let me show you. And you're going to do it in, in groups, two people. Eh, con, con un partner. I'm going to give you this link. Le voy a pasar el, este enlace. Se lo puedo pas, pasar por WhatsApp o por, eh, por eh, Zoom. Chat. ¿Cómo prefieren? Por el Zoom. WhatsApp. WhatsApp, please. Uno, vaya, los dos. <laughs> okay, very good. And, uh, teacher, teacher, uh -huh. teacher, I have a question. Yes. How do you say... Eh, hay, eh, cada seis meses es, is every six months. That's correct. Is the only form to say. That's or correct. Exist another. No, perfect. Perfect. Okay. Good job. Okay, thanks. Okay, very good. So, what's up? And on Zoom, I put on the chat the link. Okay? Van a trabajar con un, con un, uh, con un partner. Y van a completar ese ejercicio en línea. ¿Ok? Esta es una página aparte de, de, lo, de lo que es inglés corporativo, ¿verdad? So, estamos usando ejercicios extra en línea. So, eh, go to that, but first, lo voy a separar. En, uh, let me see, let me see. Uh, I have six people. I want to do... 
four and three. Ahí están. Ok. Accept the invitation. Go to the link. So, si están en su dispositivo, tendrían que tener el, el browser y también Zoom. Ok, Carla, es, uh, let me see, es que Manny aparece. Eh, Marco. Hola. Go to the, uh, the invitation para ir al, al grupo que, te, que acabo sí, de crear. Sí, es que um, lo que pasa es que por error le di salir. Ajá. Y ya, ya no veo la invitación. Que... Ah, deja ver, ok. Let me see. Mm, ya no te puedo poner en el mismo grupo. Te voy a poner en otro grupo. Ok, lo que puedes hacer, Marco, para mientras, porque ya no te puedo mandar la invitación si tú ya la cerraste. Eh, lo que puedes hacer, Marco, es trabajar. Ve a la página, al link. No sé si ya la puedes ver, el ejercicio. Sí. sí. Ok, el ejercicio es ponerlos en orden. Ok, do you see? So, eh, from one to six. Ok. So, le vas a poner un número ahí. From one to six. Mm -hmm. And then, abajo tenés otro ejercicio de escribir. De escribir eh, el, la, la oración en, su, en, en orden correcta. Ok. Mm -hmm. Y um, aquí solo le voy a poner un número o cómo. Ajá. Uh -huh. Le vas a poner el uno. Por ejemplo, eh, del uno, uh, put the, the correct, from the most often to the least. Ajá, uh -huh. so, el uno sería el más frecuente y el seis sería el más eh, no frecuente. Del uno al okay. seis. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. ¿Para mí o, o, o como debería ser? No, como debería ser. De acuerdo al cuadrito que les mandé en uh -huh. el WhatsApp, que está un cuadrito verde. Sí, está, lo recuerdo. Uh -huh. Ajá. Entonces, puedes usar ese como referencia. Ok. Ok. So, te voy a dar un ratito para que trabajes en eso. Five minutes, ¿ok? De acuerdo. Gracias. All right. Ok. Eh, el, the exercise says, hay dos ejercicios, hay uno de ponerlo en orden, el 1 al 6. El 1 el más frecuente y el 6 sería el menos fre frecuente. Ok. Y después está unas oraciones que están fuera de orden y ustedes tienen que ponerlas en orden. Ok. All right. So, pueden trabajar juntos, preguntarse. Claro, cada quien va a poner la respuesta desde, desde su computadora. Ah, ok. Ok. I'm going to give you a, a five, ten minutes for this, ok? Ok. Ok. If you have questions, let me know. Okay. Lady Gatia. Hi. In the numbers, uh, the, the one is going to be the most frequent. Okay. Six, the least frequent. Okay. Eh, ¿cómo, oh. cómo, ¿Cómo puedo eh, saber cómo van? Tienen que ver el cuadrito que puse en WhatsApp. Mm -hmm. Okay. Remember in WhatsApp, I put a picture of the, the frequency adverbs. You can use that picture to help you with that exercise. Oh. Okay, Nineve, did you understand the exercise? Yes, yes. Uh, I'm doing part. Jose uh, mm -hmm. has problems with the audio. <laughs> yes, he has problems. Voy a ver si le puedo. Jose, le voy a escribir por chat, ¿ok? Ok, Nineveh, so the first exercise, the first part, dice ponerlo del 1 al 6. One uh -huh. is going to be the most frequent. Six is going to be the, the less frequent. So okay. el 1 es el más frecuente. And then... You can look at the picture that I sent on WhatsApp, el cuadrito que puse uh -huh. en WhatsApp. Ese te va a ayudar. 
for that exercise. The <laughs> other <laughs> exercise is going to be putting the sentence in order. Okay. Okay. No, creo que al final, al final te va a decir cómo revisar. Pero ahorita okay. solo puedes trabajarlas así. Ah, perfecto. <laughs> José, eh, ¿no me puedes escuchar todavía? ¿No? José, trate de... En Zoom, en Zoom hay una opción por donde está el micrófono y hay una flechita. Eh, entonces, eh, al lado de la flechita, José, si usted le da clic a la flechita, le va a salir eh, algunas opciones. Y usted puede elegir la opción que dice test speakers y microphone, es decir, probar audífonos y micrófono. Y haga, dele clic y le va a salir un sonido. Y si usted escucha ese sonido, dice sí. Y después le va a pedir que usted haga una prueba en el audio. Diga, probando, uno, dos, tres. Y si está, entonces le va a dar sí. Si usted si, si, va, va a gra grabar su voz y después le va a dar sí. Haga esa prueba ahí que dice test speakers.
No, eh, José, no lo, no lo podemos escuchar. Sí. Lastimosamente no, todavía no lo escucho. Ok, lo que voy a hacer es que eh, los últimos dos minutos de la clase voy a compartir mi, mi pantalla con ustedes para que puedan ver cómo hacer eso, para que tú puedas ver cómo, cómo se hace esa, esa revisión. Ok. Ok. Fíjese que intenté hace un par de años, hace como cinco años, pero por cuestión de tiempo ya no, solo básicamente, valga la redundancia, el básico hice. No, pero es que el, el, el profesor, este teacher es buenísimo porque nos da grammar de otro lugar, nos da estos links, sí. eh, es, bien, es bien interactivo y, y, y yo estuve, este es mi tercer módulo, el Ajá. primero, Dios mío, o sea, el señor llegaba a, a, a desarrollar lo que estaba en la plataforma. Ajá. Pero eh, eh, este, este, este teacher es, es bien nice. No, yo aquí este, es la primera vez que participo en línea. Ah. Aquí yo digo que esto es de... Eh, eh, de pura disciplina. Sí, es correcto. Ok, very good. Regresamos. All right, okay. excellent. Ok, did you do the exercise? Ya. Yeah? Yes. yes. Voy a compartir mi pantalla con ustedes. Ok, very good. Aquí está eh, the answers. Ok. Las respuestas, number one, always. Number two, usually. Number three, often. Number five, seldom or rarely, raramente. Uh, perdón, number four, sometimes. Number five, seldom. And number six, never. Okay. Ahí está la respuesta. Teacher, mm -hmm. teacher, pero mm -hmm. y vamos a escribir toda la oración. Por ejemplo, la nueve. I always go jogging in the morning. En la segunda parte de este ejercicio, sí, ¿Eh? así era. Tenía ah, que escribir la oración completa. Okay. Eh, recuerda, yo quería que la escribiera, le di este ejercicio porque el adverb o frequency uh -huh. goes before the verb. Uh -huh. Y quería que practicaran eso, poniendo el frequency adverb primero. Ok. Very good. So, you can continue this exercise and then check the answers. Ok. You can finish this tomorrow, or si quieren terminar ahora, trabajarlo, you can do it. Ok, solo quiero enseñarles esto, a los que están teniendo problemas con el audio. Cuando ustedes eh, ingresen, les va a pedir, cuando eh, ingresen a Zoom, les va a, pedir, les va a decir ahí, le va a dar un mensaje, iniciar Zoom con el audio de este dispositivo. Le pueden dar sí. Y, y conectar su dispositivo, su, sus audífonos, perdón. Pero hay una forma como revisar que todo está bien. Y esto lo pueden hacer ustedes. Le, ya cuando están en Zoom, van al micrófono aquí. Si ustedes ven, el micro, micrófono sube y baja la, la varita verde, el color verde. Significa que está funcionando. Pero puede por veces haber, a, a, haber existir algún problem, un problema. Entonces lo que puedo hacer es... Ir aquí donde dice revisar 
micrófono y audífonos. Test speakers and microphone. Entonces, lo que escucho es un tono primero. Y si yo escucho ese tono, le digo yes. Ese es para revisar de que yo pueda escuchar la clase. Después vengo aquí. Yo puedo grabar mi voz. Y darle sí. Si todo está bien, si yo escucho mi voz, finish. ¿Ok? Ustedes deberían de hacer eso antes si tienen algún problema. Para que no tengan problema escuchando la clase o hablando durante la clase. ¿Ok? okay. Eh, creo que tuvimos una, una persona ahí que tuvo problemas. Ok. ¿Questions? ¿Preguntas? No, pues. No. no ok, pues. very good. So, eh, re, hagan el, la, el ejercicio 1.2, 1.3, 1.4. Y, el, y pueden continuar, ¿ok? Después del 1.5 es una revisión de lo que vimos ahora. ¿Questions? No, no. Question. Ok, very good. I have another class, so I have to finish on time, ¿ok? But okay. Uh, okay. if you have any questions, please write me. Ok. Ok, I'll see you tomorrow. Excellent. See you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Good night. Bye bye, everyone. Bye bye. Take care. Bye. Mm -hmm.